anyway, anyway If I hit it one time, it will be better days Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's Lombe again and I'm back with another banging video. If you're new to my channel, welcome to my channel. My name is Lombe. Make sure you hit the subscribe button, thumbs up this video, and share with your mom and your papa and your auntie. And if you're not new, welcome back. First of all, let me talk about how I didn't upload for two weeks when I said I would upload. I got sick, yeah, I got the influenza virus that's been going around. I was down for a week and then I broke out because of the flu and like I just wasn't looking cute. And so today I decided to record. I'm literally like, this is me recording before I go to class. As we speak, my subscriber count is, let me check. 34,800 and before I made the Rema video I was on 28,000 thank you so much to everyone who subscribed like that's my most viewed video and it's understandable but thank you so much for all your sweet comments and like all the love and like I went to the movies and I, I met so many of you and I was shy oh my god I was so shy <laughs> But thank you so much for all the love. I've had people from Nigeria text me, people from South Africa. And so hopefully we get to 50K and we do a meet and greet. I mean, it's moving faster than I expected. So I have to do this meet and greet thing. But I mean, it's just all thanks to God. And God has been great. And I mean, when it's your time, it's your time to shine, okay? When it's your time, nobody should take it away from you. Your wings need to spread. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> So a lot of you had a lot of questions about how it happened and your assumptions. I know some of you have gone to car, but oh way, Lombe is dating Rema. <laughs> Lombe. At Lombe was with Rema. How did she get that? Ah, she's so sneaky. Yeah, you know, I think what she wants to think. As Jack Harlow once said, I don't clear up rumors. Where's the sense of humor? Medica rumor. Yes, continue. Continue to spray those rumors. <laughs> It just makes me so much happier that, hey, she really thinks that I was dating Rima. <laughs> I'm not here to clear up any rumors. If you want to think whatever happened for me to do that, think it. On the other side, for those of you who genuinely want to know how I got it and what happened. So basically, it was Saturday afternoon when I saw the DM. I got a message from Sean, who's Rima's manager. There's an influencers party that's going on, which I was not invited for. He... <laughs> Oh, hey, Lombe, did you get the invitation for the influencers party? And I said, there's an influencers party? And he's like, yeah. And I was like, I didn't get no invitation. So whoever was supposed to send those invitations and didn't invite me. Shame. You see that? When God says yes, nobody can say no. <laughs> Either way, I wouldn't have attended because it's on Saturday and you guys know I don't do Saturday stuff. And he said, we would love for you to meet Rima at the party tonight. And I was like, I don't do Saturdays. And I said, God. I want to meet Rema, but manji, what am I, manji, such a boy, what am I going to do? And so, like, I tried my luck, and you know me, like, no matter, even if I'm meeting Chris Brown, even if I'm meeting BTS, if it's on Saturday, I'm not gonna do it because those are my values and values over anything. The weapons were really being fashioned, but oh my god, like, I serve a living God, you know what I'm saying? Like, for a long time, I was like, I'm never gonna have these gigs that all my, all my influencer friends have because me, I'm a Sabbath girl, and most of them on Saturday, I'm never gonna meet artists and like have it like, but go. God, when God says, I'll open the ways, I'll set up a table for you in front of your enemies. My enemies were eating, they were choking. <laughs> Even though I was going, I was potentially losing the chance to meet Rima, I just said it. I said, um, I don't do Saturday stuff. And I said, I'm out of town because really, I live out of town. I was far. But he was like, oh, I see. But it's like, I re we really want to set something up with you and Rima. And I was like, I said, oh God. <laughs> What happened was I told him, can we meet on Sunday? And he was like, um, yeah, sure. I said, how long are you here? He said, we're here till Tuesday. And so long story short, couldn't meet on Sunday because, ah, no, I actually dressed up and I went on Sunday. And if you know, Rema did his concert on Saturday evening, but it didn't go well. So he did another concert on Monday. So on Sunday, I said, okay, I'm going to meet him at his rooftop. We're going to make a video. It's going to be fun. Da, 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 da. As I'm on my way there, you know, I'm looking cute. I've done my little afro. I'm on my way there and they tell me, oh, sorry, we can't meet, you can't meet Rema and do the video right now because you don't have time. He has a lot of stuff scheduled. He has a sound check. He has to go to the radio station. He has to do da, 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 da. And yo, I actually gave up. I said, ah, then it's fine. Next time when you come, I actually texted this rubbish. I was like, it's fine then. Next time when you come. Then I, I said, wait a minute. <laughs> so... 
Then I was like, wait a minute, wait a damn minute, Lombe, hold on. When are you ever going? Okay, when are you ever going to see Rema again? Okay, think about it. So I sent that rubbish. I said, hell no, it's not gonna happen. I sent it, and then I thought about it again. Is there a way we can meet today? <laughs> You don't have to come to me, I'll come to where you guys are. And so he said, yeah, sure, you can come for the sound check. And so I came all the way to where I stay, out of town again. Changed, got changed, picked my friend, because my friend is such a big Rima fan. I picked her up and I'm like, girl, let's go see your mans. <laughs> And so we went with my sister to the music club. We sat outside for like a good hour because I'm thinking Rema hasn't arrived yet. And I'm texting Sean like, hey Sean, are you here? How should how do I get in? Da, 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 da. And I was like, I was confused because there's no door that you knock on. And then I called my friend Jay. Yeah, Jay Trigger, you know my friend. Oh my god. By the way, go stream Jay Trigger's music. He's a great musician. Yeah, I called Jay and I was like, Jay, are you with Rema right now? And he's like, yeah, we're in the music club. So Jay somehow managed to get me in. And yeah, this is the footage from that day. So this is the actual vlog now of how that day went. So roll the footage. Hi guys, so I'm here to um I'm here at the music club. I'm here to meet somebody. But you don't know. I don't know. <laughs> it's going to happen. Maybe they didn't let me, I don't know. But yeah, um hopefully it goes well. <laughs> I'll just show you guys if if it if it goes so if it doesn't go well I'm gonna show you guys. I don't know how long I'll be sitting here, but I'll show you guys. Guys, let me tell you, I'm so nervous I could pass away. <laughs> I can actually pass away. I bought those are locked, so we have to wait. Please thank God I had Jay's number because imagine if I didn't have Jay Trigger's number. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god, you guys. Oh my god. What is it, Rema? Look at it. Chanda is beaming. <laughs> oh, no, because because I'm meeting Jay Sugar for the first time. Oh my god. Hello. Fine, thank you. How are you? I'm Lombe. Of course, yeah. What do you mean? Hi. <laughs> meeting Jay for the first time. What? Yes. Yes. Have we met before? Oh, I can fall down. Yes. It's our first time.
Oh, Every, really? Yeah. Oh, nice. So can I, do you mind being in my vlog? Saying hi. All I have to do is say hi. Yes. Just, just say hi. Say something. Something. <laughs> <laughs> okay, something else. <laughs> something else. <laughs> so, ladies and gentlemen, subscribe to Long the Bossa. Subscribe to Long the Bossa. Subscribe to Long the Bossa. <laughs> Yeah, otherwise it was so fun. It was like you guys. I tell you what, I only knew like four or five Rema songs when he came. But after watching him perform the songs, you guys, he's such an amazing oh my god. Wow, I was wow, that was wow. You know, I ended up liking a lot more of his music just watching him live. And I also watched my friend Jay live, like oh guys, wow. Jay, I think Jay already knows. I'm ready to him I'm so proud of him. I am. And we I met Maki too and he was so funny. I'm sure you guys have seen, you've seen, like he's a funny guy. He said subscribe, so make sure you subscribe. So what happened was I thought that it would end on the sound check and I was really grateful, like that's all I needed really. I didn't intend on like forcing a video or anything. If meeting him like this is, is good, then that's fine. I talked to Sean one more time and he was like, oh, no, we can do a video on Monday. And I couldn't do a video on Monday because I was having, a, again, another religious purpose. I was having another like situation. If you follow me on Instagram, you probably know. Yeah, I was having another another one of my religious holidays. And I was like, I can't do, I cannot do it. You know, they were willing to let me go for his concert. As you had Rema say, he, he told me, did I not invite you? <laughs> He's like, did I not invite you? So I told them I can't make it for Monday. I said I have school. Tuesday was the day I really had school. And Tuesday was the day they were leaving. So I assumed the day you're leaving, you're doing a bunch of stuff, you won't have time to see me. But Sean was like, no, we are going to make this video work. You're going to see him on Tuesday before his flight. And I was like, oh my God, wow. Anyway, Pon Fashion again is me and my family. Backfire. <laughs> so okay, no. Sorry. <laughs> anyway, that's what happened. So I met Rima Tuesday morning before his flight, and you guys, he was so nice. I thought he was going to come in, you know, with with grills and shades, and you know, I saw him like he's just a normal boy, like he's just a kid, like he's just a normal twenty-two year old boy. And we had so much fun. And I mean, you guys saw the video, you saw. I I was really nervous at first, but then he made me like really comfortable, and I think he felt comfortable. And I I don't know if he's seen the video up to now. And you know, some of you are texting me like, oh. Did you get his number? Like, I wasn't trying to cross those lines. Like, I was trying to respect him as well. I mean, I'm not going to force him to follow me. I'm not going to force him to give me his number. I would much rather he was like, let me follow him because I couldn't is good. I don't force things, you know what I'm saying? So I was like, nah, this is enough for me. I'm grateful. Like, even if he doesn't remember me after so long, I'm like, me, I'm grateful I met him. That's all that matters. Please don't text me like, oh, please don't be. Can you tell Rema for me? I don't have his number, guys. And it's not going to work. In a nutshell, I mean, I'm really grateful. So many things have happened for me even after meeting Rima. So many great things and I mean you guys are going to see them soon I didn't record this part, but like after we finished recording the video the first thing he did when he got up that chair He went straight to my mom and he's like, hello <laughs> Okay, that's so sweet. He's like, hey mom. What did he say? Oh, I don't know what he said. He was like, hey mom, you have such an amazing daughter. She has such an amazing personality. You've done a great job raising her. You know, I'm really happy that you're encouraging her. You're such a good parent. Keep encouraging her. Like, he talks about how his mom wanted him to do law. You know, it took her a while to learn to support what he loves. And, like, he's like, the father that you're here with your daughter. And, like, you know, he said a bunch of sweet stuff. Like, it was so sweet. And then that photo we took, this photo. Yeah, he had complimented my shoes. And we had taken this photo. And he was like, yeah, let's take a shoe gang photo. You know, let's do, let's do shoe gang. Yeah, he's such a fun, chilled person. And that's what I wanted you guys to see. That these people, they're normal people. Some of them are mean, and know but like i'm glad that he was a nice person yeah so thank you so much to all my new subscribers i hope you enjoy my content and you stay here for the content i'm writing exams in two weeks so i will be unavailable on this you know i'm sorry i'm so sorry like i'm sorry but i promise you <laughs> 
<laughs> no, it's like I know by now you guys are so sick and tired of my empty promises. But when I'm done with exams, I'll be here. It's like you know, I'm really trying to give everything in this semester. And yeah, so that's basically how it happened. I still can't believe it happened. And like you know, because when you're in the moment, you don't see how big it is for you. But I'm I'm so grateful and I'm so happy. And candles for more blessings. Candles for more showers of blessings. Anyway, I have to go to school. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for subscribing, all the love. Thank you so much for the constructive criticism as well. I will get a microphone, hopefully. You know what I'm saying? I don't intend on making this channel a place for interviewing artists, but I mean, if that's what you guys want, I'm open to that idea. <laughs> I'm now stammering, because I, I, I don't know what to say. See you guys in my next video. <laughs>